Hey everybody, it's Steve. Welcome back to Surviving Mars, Blue Sun Rising. We're going to start this episode looking at our extractors here, just outside of exploit number one. Our metals extractor, we currently have Jen Wee and Virginia Trenton working in there. Our rare metals extractor just has Cassandra Zuckerman working in there. And we still have plenty of metals and rare metals available. But looking at the overall colony, we're not doing that bad. Um, we Last episode we brought in a bunch of new colonists, which is good. Um, running into an issue in that it doesn't seem like they're very comfortable. Um, we're bringing down a lot of supplies. Uh, we're running low on machine parts right now. Food could be a little better. Um, just doing a lot to make sure we have uh, proper food in there. And I am worried that um, only one person working at this farm is going to lead to a crop failure. We have a lot of vacant slot. We have a lot of vacant uh, spots for jobs. So what I'm thinking about doing this episode, I still want to leave this partially open to serve as a connector to a new dome when we build it. So I think what the objective of this episode is, make the colonists more comfortable and try to get this number and this number to match. We do have some seniors, so we've got people outside the workforce right now. Last episode, we did unlock the apartment technology so I'm going to actually build some apartments on Mars. I know people aren't going to like that, but there's a technology that might actually help us with that. Systematic training is a heavily needed thing, but also dome bioscaping. We need to get that going too. And I'll most likely dismantle one of the living quarters so we can get more people working in here. They're not going to be as comfortable. Hmm. Second thought, probably won't do that until we get dome bioscaping done because I want these domes to be a little more comfortable for everybody to keep that birth rate up. So far on Mars, we have three children. They're all in school right now. They in school kids. The apartment complex will kind of help house once we get some more colonists down here. I'm thinking about just bringing down another load and saying, you know what, guys? We got to fill it up. Get to work. I could build an art store in this dome. It does consume polymers. In fact, let's build an art store. It'll just kind of remind me that uh, that is one we can't use. We'll bring down some more uh, colonists because we have people matching what's available to us. We even have a vegan coming down. Sweet. Okay, 16 colonists matching. Capacity 12. Bring them. Hopefully these colonists will start working in these uh, facilities. I almost want to turn off, allow pa use passages for work, but the school's down here and one of our main nurseries is up here. We have one person in a nursery here and two people in nurseries up there. So kind of want to avoid doing that. We got our soil quality on our farms up pretty darn close to 100%. So we're cranking out wheat here every other day. We're pumping out about 20 food. We do have a little bit of a power fall off right now. Um, that's not great. So let's, uh, ooh, wait a second. We are low on machine parts, so that's going to be an issue. I wanted to build more turbines, but without the people working in the machine parts factory, we're running into an issue. Uh, we have an unemployed person. Sector are you scan. unemployed, Victor? Anomaly found. You're a youth. I assign you to here. There you go, Victor. Again, goal is to get these numbers to match. The infirmary's not working. There we go. Perfect. Alright. Food-wise, again, we got 24, 23 food coming out right now. There we go. Our robots are going to go down here, and they're going to grab it all up. Take it out to our depots. Well, our depot, singular. And this guy's just dumping off metal, so he's been repaired. He uh, broke down in the last episode. We'll bring back our RC commander. And, oh, we actually don't have any metal storage available. Whoops. Alright, um... 
Guess we'll put a Metals Depot down here. Sure, why not? Got plenty of fuel for any shuttles that need to come up. Actually, a phone call I'm gonna need to make as soon as I finish recording this episode. Got family traveling today. Alright. See if we can get that machine parts issue addressed this episode, too. Sector Come on down! Anomaly found. Oh, look at that. So much research available down there. That's what makes the machine parts so critical in this colony, because we need them for the tunnel. Slight New fall off on power, which is fine, because we do have these... We do have 800 power stored right now, and we can just add some more wind turbines up there if we need to. It looks like the jobs are starting to match up. I'm actually going to just make this one specialists only on the farm because I want them to I want everybody who's working here, I want them to be botanists. Here I'm not going to require it. Resources are low. And I'm actually going to open up a second shift here. I'm opening up a second shift on the machine parts factory. Let's keep that one to see if we can get that increased. Get that number up. Here, would have loved to open up the second shift on it. Screw it, gonna. Wow, we got people working there. Actually, I'm gonna keep that second shift off on this one, because we don't need it. Machine parts, we need it. Electronics. Let's see. What's our... Okay, so we have a plus on that. Polymer factory. We got polymers coming. Um, ooh, wow, you have five on board. Go. Take it. So the service comfort Sector in here, scan. that's gonna, that's hopefully is gonna increase the comfort in this dome. Resources are low. Alright, um, let's see. Gaming, gambling, shopping. This is a shopping building. <laughs> um, let's see. Social. So essentially they're asking for a space bar. Or the casino complex. Not willing to build a casino complex yet. Because right now we're just in the basics. We need to get this going. Research complete. Sweet. More research done. I like that. Alright, storage compression. Ooh, storage is available. That's gonna be a good one. Storage compression, though, I need to get that one knocked out. And then we're just going to keep going on the line that we have here. Don't want to bring down machine parts unless I absolutely have to. And I think we can make enough here on the colony to keep things going. Yeah, we got a plus of about half. Not good. And this one needs some electronics. I do like that it's... Uh, when the game first came out, I'm not sure if uh, some of you are aware of this, one of the big complaints that uh, gamers had was that you needed machine parts, or electronics I should say, to maintain... You needed electronics to maintain the electronics factory. Now, if you're if you're new to the series, that's something that was in the original part of the game. One of the updates, they actually changed it so that you would ne actually need machine parts to maintain the electronics factory and electronics to maintain the machine parts factory. A little bit of symbiosis that actually keeps them working. You know, essentially need both of them to keep working. Now, dust I have any machine parts available but over here, because this one's gonna need it. Yeah, we got some there. Oh, wow. That's where all of our electronics are hiding out. Um... Hmm. I'm thinking about moving those elsewhere, but I think it's fine for right now. Alright, uh, this concrete deposit is almost gone, which means I'm going to be uh, just getting rid of it. We do have another concrete deposit here off to the south. There's plenty there. Sector just scan. curious. Hmm. I could put it right on the edge. It would mine all of it out. Which is another change in one of the recent updates. I think a drone hub right here would be really good. Let's actually drop down 
Oh, I don't have the tech yet. That's the technology I need to unlock. Oh well. A little bit more cash coming in. How many rare metals have we exported? Seven. Seven total, that's it? Hmm. Pretty sure we exported more than that. Hmm. Uh, graphs, I guess? Rear metals. Huh. I do like this graph that we're actually showing the consumption of it, but it doesn't show how much I've exported. We had that peak up just once, or a couple of times. Sector scanned. Hmm. It's very helpful if you like the graphs, uh, being able to go through all that. Me, I just like this to help me relax after a rough day at work. What are we moving? Oh, it's all the metals being moved over here. Oh, rare metals are there! Yay! Uh, another text there from the future wife. Oh, is this? Those, uh, I was seeing the little ripple effect. I was thinking it was coming from the cable itself. It's coming from this guy. Oh. Scanning-wise, oh my god. We have so much down here. What was that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven researches that I gotta get to down there. Let's see. Boost, 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 boost. Either way, we're going to scan it all. Hmm. I think... I'm a little concerned we're not going to be able to... Make that goal, because... How much... Oh, he's done. Sector scanned. Goodbye. We got 500 concrete, so we're good for now. Not machine parts, that's what I need. Yeah, we're getting a couple per day, and I think I just got a little bit back out of that. Yep, I got a machine part out of that one. And there was much rejoicing. Yay. Alright, I'm gonna salvage the cable. Okay, it is still connected. That's good. Tisk, tisk, tisk. I know opening up these second shifts on a few of these uh, in-demand locations, that's going to keep this number from getting low, but at the same time, we need to get the colonists. I'm trying to figure out if we need to actually do another, uh, another dome just for people. The big thing is, it's got to connect up to that rare metals extractor, and it's in cold territory, I do like that it reminds you of that. Sector um, scanned. Let's look about... If I did a basic dome, I'd have to go all the way here just to get it. So, that's a long distance it's got to connect. Barrel dome. Another barrel dome. I could put it in somewhere like here. But again, it's a stretch to get away from that dome and over to here. That's why a medium dome and a low G engineering is going to be needed. What the heck? When did that... Oh, uh, that must have been just a random meteor that came in. That was not there a minute ago. I could bring down most of them. 495 million. With the rare metals I got, I could probably earn that all back quick. Getting that research done, though. I think that's going to help me a lot. So, we're going a little hectic. You. I want to put him on that hex, because that's actually going to represent the overlay spot between the two drone hubs.
I think I want a ways with this. Sector scanned. We're doing it. The machine parts will get there last, which kind of sucks. But at the same time, we've got the resources to get there with what we have. So we'll get all the concrete, we'll get the metals over there. Wow, they already put machine parts over to it. I'm kind of upset about that, actually. Oh, well. And I'm kind of upset that I've been talking so long my tea has gone cold. And we are actually producing five per day. I'm going to actually turn off the heavy load on this because it is putting a strain on our folks and I need these folks I need um, I need the people working out here to be well rested where are you you're coming back with stuff cool uh oh that's probably what hit him another dust devil oh well Sector scanned. Sweet, more metals. Love it. And once we get down there, I'll put a uh, depot down there. So, a little robot. Hey, hey. They're all hey, hey. They are. The pathing on them, they could be better. Complete. Storage compression, so now... <laughs> now everything's like, sweet, we can start pumping things again. Boom. Let's bring all that down. The rare metals that have been uh, that are stockpiling, we're going to ship them out. We're going to get a little bit closer to our valuation goal and get some more cash flowing our way. Hopefully the machine parts are going to end up going to the right spot, whether it be to the domes, to the maintenance, or to the tunnel. Looks like right now the concrete is just going there, which is good. Mm, heavy load on whom? Yeah, we need to get more drones for you, sir. Oh, look at that. So many exports on board. You're ready? Nope, not ready to go. You're close, though. We gather here today to bid a final farewell to one of our finest. Casimir Maurer. Uh, let's see. I, think he, I don't know if he was the, the normal founder, or... If he's the first founder who passed away. I don't think we need to actually go see his body. This isn't stand by me. Resources are low. Most of them admittedly are right there. Yeah, <laughs> there's uh, 20 <laughs> machine parts and construction sites right now. I could just get rid of that and we'd have machine parts for weeks. Sector scanned. Okay. So we got polymers coming. How's your sanity doing? I'm gonna drop you down to a regular load. Yeah, you're creating let's see one polymer. What's our uh Okay, yeah. We're actually gonna need to keep that one probably on a heavy loader at a second shift. Oh, more kids in school. I'm happy. Uh, Martian Institute of Science, uh, so we can get them trained up. That is going to be on the list, unfortunately. I don't have the tech for it yet. It's going to be coming up, though. I'm confident. Um, does this need power? Oh, I'm so happy. You um, actually start scanning these. If it ends up being one of the mysteries that we already had done, we're going to keep going. But, let me drop a universal down here. Because I think he's going to keep mining everything up here. Here we go. Now that the most critical phase of the mission is behind us, we would argue it's a good time to start focusing on our mission evaluation goals. Alright, we're about a third of the way there. We have 35 rare metals exported, plus 
I think another 15 on the way back, so we're halfway to our goal right now. I'm liking that. And look, there are just tons of metal out here. I don't like that that just decided to pop up. And we're just going to scan along that. I'll probably get uh, the robots Anomaly to... Analyzed. Someone joked we found kryptonite. It was because of the greenish-yellow hue of the beryl crystals. I was hoping it was going to be kryptonite. All right. Physics test. Physics test. Physics technology research. I'm just go with that one. Reduced by 10%. That's super helpful for us because when the MDS lasers become... show up for us, it's going to get cheaper. So I'm liking that. Oh, cool. We got the mega storages, too. We've gotten a lot of uh, text messages while we've been recording these last two episodes. How do, I, how do I have seven text messages? I've only heard my my watch has only buzzed once. Sector scanned. Most of them from my future wife. So those are the important ones. Oh, I need some extractor AI badly. Oh, look at that. Just lots of metals available for us. It's a good day. There we go. There were no secrets to find near the anomaly site. Nah. Just a scene of breathtaking beauty. Okay. Ending received. Okay, that was actually not uh, connected. So we have the celebrity applicant, but it's not because of the, what we just of that photo op thing that we found. So celebrities, obviously, they generate uh, funding for us, but at the same time, we got a pretty good amount of funding coming from the rare metals we're mining out of the ground. We've only pulled up 55 rare metals so far, so we're doing pretty good. How's your sanity doing on this one? Yeah. Just kind of want to check in on everybody, make sure they're okay. Baby's being born, baby's being born. Liking it. I didn't realize, oh, well, if you want to have ton of water and power connecting through them, obviously, you would need to have the, the piping going to it. That's helpful. But lots of stuff to research. That's just messing with me. How we doing? Almost done. Then when we get a cool technology we want to research like the MDSs, we'll absolutely uh, kick that one into high gear. We'll finish that one off, we'll do the keys, and then we'll decide, okay, what do we want to use those flat researches on to boost them quick. Sector scanned. Sweet, more metal. And in reality, there's going to be a ton of metal just piled up around this one. and Because he's down here now. He's, he's munching it all up. Transport optimization may be needed to actually Anomaly increase analyzed. his uh, work. Until today, the only place we'd thought you could find Ice-15 outside of a lab was on an icy planet or a moon. And here we find it on Mars. Extra 500 million in cash? Thank you. So there's that metal deposit we found. 873, it's not bad. Getting that extractor AI, I could strip mine this planet. Just a technology, you only get a certain number of breakthroughs, and that's like, I want them! We got plenty of food right now. I'm legitimately surprised that we're able to produce as much food uh, on just two farms. I think getting this one just loaded up with the botanists is super helpful for us. Let's see if there's any botanists working elsewhere, where we just say, like, hey, can you go work? Can you go to your specialty, please? We need you to work in that. You're a scientist. Oh, Virginia Trenton, she left, uh, she left the mine. And we have some, uh, no-spec people working out in the polymer factory. Anomaly analyzed. There's more to the barren and... Battery optimization. Increased uh, drone capacity, so less time they got to go and uh, recharge. And low G engineering. Sweet, that's a technology we absolutely need on the planet. Now if you could go please scan that one. Ugh. 
cold tea, really. Um, when it's hot initially, it's good, but... Um, what's the one I'm thinking of? There was a... Uh, we need to get the shuttle hubs. That I think we need to get also to just move stuff around this planet so much faster. We can just have metals going everywhere. Sector scanned. <gasps> found. A breakthrough! You're going there next. Finish scanning. And then you're going up there. Anomaly analyzed. There's more to the barren environs of the red planet. All right, we got 3D machining, so we can build machine parts factories. Compact passenger modules, great news. Gene adaptation, 7,000. We're already up to the 7,000 level for that. Sterling generators we can make. And there's the Martian University. Wow, only 2,000 for that. That is much lower than I thought it was going to be. So we're totally going to do that too. I think I'm going to use the boosts for the Logi engineering because that medium dome is going to really help us kind of kickstart this colony and get us into a more comfortable setup. We can bring more colonists down, have a lot more factories working, and almost like a one-stop shop for where our colonists need to be. But let's see what this is going to be. I know in the city building challenge that's going on right now that the second episode well, no the first episode i should say came out today earlier to not early today i'm recording on thursday this episode's coming out on friday it came out yesterday morning it's been that been up for a few hours already so city building part one we got the oval architecture that's one i hadn't seen Thank before discovered. <gasps> oh neocrete this is actually going to keep the Concrete costs reduced by 80%. Considering we have 420 wheat Research concrete complete. right now, that's actually a huge boost for us. All right. Um, so we only have... We have two of them. I don't want it to go to systematic training, even though it would, go to, it would do so much for us. I'm going to put it up to... Low-G Engineering. And I want to boost Low-G Engineering. I think that's actually going to help us the most. How many? Me wow, we got some metals out here. And I'm just going to let Hey Hey keep doing his thing. I probably could drop down a sensor tower. I tw wow, we got 23 electronics. But at the same time, I only have nine polymers. Hmm. And also, that medium dome, we're going to be able to put a lot more people in it. But it's just like, just conveyor belt, conveyor belt. A lot of passages just to get to this one. So maybe another polymer factory would be put out here or by the new dome. <clears throat> also needed, we're going to have to put a drone hub right there, I think. Anomaly analyzed. There we go. Alright. So, low G engineering is pretty much half done now. They're a third of the way done. Close enough. Wow. Even when... Meteor shower incoming. Here we go again, kids. Even with the infirmary not here... The comfort level is high enough where we're getting kids born. And I think these are the right ones to do because enth enthusiast just boost a high morale doesn't do us much, and then nerd. Well, not, ooh, what do we have? What do we have? <gasps> Break off. Just pull them off immediately. He's actually like halfway done with that one. Feel kind of bad, but at the same time, if that's a breakthrough that we need or want, desperately, desperately want, then I want to make sure that's prioritized. We're doing good on Logi Engineering. We've got actually quite a bit of funding right now. Uh, 13, 13 uh, rare metals Mars side, which is good. Would like to get this up to a point where I'm getting... Uh, where I can send back a full load, but we need the people. 
said that people is the limiting factor. If you uh, remember your old chemistry classes uh, for reactions, if it's not a full um, if you don't have an equal number of a component to make a reaction, you have that limiting element or that limiting factor. Right now it's humans. We're gonna need that polymer for the new dome now. <gasps> You're all fired. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. <laughs> I just did that. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm stupid. Uh, <laughs> okay, that's at the top of the list. Oh my god, I just did that. <laughs> Hopefully you just laughed at that. I really hope you laughed. Because that was so stupid. <laughs> what if we got a cargo rocket? Um, I'm just going to bring down some polymers. No electronics. <laughs> Great, you discovered the breakthrough. You can research it. I already have it. Perfect! So we know what we're going to do in the next episode. We're going to get Extractor AI research, and then I'm going to strip mine this bitch. Uh, <laughs> I hope you got a laugh out of that. I really do. Are low. We're low on machine parts. We're low on polymers, but we're going to be fine. I'm bringing in some more, and <laughs> we're going to start strip mining this planet. <laughs> Oh. Hopefully that uh, brought you a laugh if you're watching this on the day it came out on Friday. Whichever day that you're watching this on, I hope you had a little bit of a chance to laugh at how stupid that was. You got to relax a little Anomaly bit, because that's the point the of this series. Well. That's the point of my channel most of the time. Get people to relax. There's a lot of stressful stuff going on out there in the world. There's a lot of stresses you probably have in your life, but hopefully watching my videos, this video maybe for the last 30 minutes or so, you got a chance to relax. You got a chance to forget about it, kind of veg out, and just enjoy something. Try to find that every day in your lives, folks. Like, comment, or subscribe if you enjoy the videos that come out on my channel. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you all in the next video.